The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. That object is different from the others. It does not appear to be the same type of pod we've seen used by the aliens during their abduction operations. We may gain new insights if we recover it. Be advised, Commander. Intel confirms enemy activity in this area. Will do. This appears to be a containment device of some kind. We can only assume it has an internal self-destruct mechanism, like the other alien equipment. Although it must have already been disabled somehow. There may be additional canisters like this one in the area. The more we can recover, the more we'll learn about what's inside them. Any others you find may still have operational self-destruct modules. Be careful. Affirmativo. life on Earth. We are witnessing something never before seen in recorded history. Eyes on the prize. Double time. Designated position. I'm on the watch. When you love us. appear to self-destruct when the operator dies. We should look closely for any fragments that could be salvaged for our own development programs. Roger that. 
merely an the object energy inside. signature coming from that device implies the self-destruct mechanism is still intact and priming for detonation. You'll need to move quickly to recover it before it's too late. Manos a la obra. Good copy, moving on target. I feel better. <laughs> Excellent work, Commander. That should provide us with an ample supply of this substance for analysis. Well done, Commander. Recovering this material should give us a leg up on whatever it is the aliens are developing. I'm sure the doctors will be eager to get started. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold. Providing tactical support for our field operations and keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Our snipers specialize in dealing massive amounts of damage from afar. But without sufficient training, they're vulnerable in close combat situations. The assault class serves as our front line. They're the first ones into a fight, and the last ones out. Just like it sounds, the support class provides that intangible edge our squads need. They make everyone around them better. The heavy weapons specialist provides a crucial service to the squad. With the rocket launcher in tow, there are demolitions experts. The recovered artifacts are being unloaded and the research team is waiting your orders. Hello, Commander. My name is Dr. Farlan. I oversee the research labs. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. We have already begun analyzing the artifacts recovered from our first encounter with the aliens. Based on our preliminary findings, we believe we can use them to develop some new equipment for our soldiers. With your approval, we will begin research immediately. Research labs. I agree, that does seem to be the most pressing of our current research options. We'll begin immediately. I will notify you when a complete report is available. Ah, Commander. I was wondering when you'd be stopping by. Welcome to engineering. Anything they can dream up in the research labs, we can build it here. Speaking of which, Dr. Valen has just sent us some new schematics. With your approval, we will begin fabrication. We've still got some room to grow up here, but if we really want to expand our facilities, we're going to have to start excavating beneath the base. Unfortunately, the deeper we go, the more it's going to cost. Mission Control. Commander to Mission Control. Commander to Mission Control. Commander to Mission Control. Commander, 
We picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. putting down in Mexico for this mission. Strike one, this is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. Yes, Commander. Commander. I'm on the move. Roger, I've got my eyes on. 
Heading there now. I feel, Commander. Moving out. Got something over here. to position. to that location. I feel you, Commander. I'm on it, Commander. I'm on the watch.
got me flanked. Roger that. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We can begin researching the newly recovered artifacts immediately. Commander to the Situation Room. Commander to the Situation Room. Impressive work, Commander. Our soldiers have to be feeling good after a mission like that. Engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Commander to the Situation Room. Commander to the Situation Room. To the situation room. Commander to the situation room. Council is going to want satellite coverage, so we should plan our deployments carefully. receiving you. We'll monitor that contact, but I don't think it's related to the UFO activity. Nothing to report at the moment. Boards are clear.
technology has a number of potential applications. I'm sure the science team is eager to begin. I'll notify you as soon as we have something significant to report. on the bandit. Central, this is Voodoo 37. We have a confirmed kill on Bogey 001. I repeat, the UFO is down. I'll copy, over. Solid copy, Voodoo 37. Nice work. Central out. All right, people. Retask Recon Satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. Magnify. Still in one piece. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. Ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. This is Big Sky. We're just north of the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Я в пути. Roger that. Я 
в пути! Ясно, буду на чеку. to instruct your men to exercise restraint when using explosives. While certainly effective at killing aliens, they also destroy the artifacts we're hoping to recover from the bodies. Just something to consider. On my way! Overwatch! Aye aye. Moving to designated coordinates. Есть, выполняю. Got it covered. Enemies in sight. Things can't be right. Is there fun? That's a being of almost pure energy. I've killed, Commander. Готовность номер один.
пробежаться. on the move. Location confirmed. Headed there now. Mission accomplished. Looks like they're really taking care of business down there, and without so much as a scratch. Commander, I realize our troops have to put their own survival first, but every alien we use explosives against is one less opportunity to recover new artifacts. That would be a priority research task, Commander. I'll begin allocating resources to the project immediately.
So, what is it, Doctor? It's remarkable. The crystalline structure housed within the canister is actually a suspension containing billions of cybernetic nanomachines, each made up of both organic and mechanical components. My team's analysis indicates these microscopic robots are capable of assembling mechanical structures with unprecedented efficiency. With further study and some specialized facilities, we may be able to engineer a sort of cybersuit that interfaces with the human body. My team is more interested in the possibility of physically altering the tissue itself, incorporating aspects of the alien's own genetic adaptations by using the nanites to fuse the foreign material. The commander will have to decide where the greatest advantage lies. Is there anything you agree on? Given the apparent purpose of the nanites, they allow combining organic materials with one another, or with machines. We have at least agreed to call them... Meld. Work crews are on their way to begin construction. I'll send word when the new facility is operational. Commander, we're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Central, this is Big Sky. 
Strike team is touching down now. Standing by for your orders. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. Yes, sir. Буду на чеку. That's affirmative. I feel, Commander. Moving. Watch. Aye, aye.
Поправка на ветер. up another one. Remember, 
We will be watching. Commander, you can now honor our soldiers by awarding them medals for accomplishments you deem appropriate. You can view and award medals in the barracks. You're telling me that we should risk the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive? Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The autopsy I've just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause neuromuscular... Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? I do. We do not know our enemy. How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture one of these creatures alive, we may be able to communicate with it. And interrogate it. Find out what they want. Where they're operating from. Yes. That possibility outweighs all risks, in my opinion. I can construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. I'm still having a hard time grasping what it is the aliens are hoping to accomplish here. Are they studying us? Why abduct humans seemingly at random? There must be a pattern that we haven't established yet. Recent results were beyond our expectations, and that is not a statement this council makes lightly.
We will be in touch, Commander. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. From what little I've seen of their technology, if the aliens were intent on conquering Earth, there's not much we could do to stop them. I'm guessing they have in mind. Online. The soldiers who volunteer for mech trooper augmentation sacrifice much, but they do not leave themselves entirely behind. A mech trooper will be able to apply some of the training and knowledge from his or her previous combat specialty to the cybersuit's operation. With this facility, we'll be able to build mechanized exoskeletal cybersuits, or mechs and implant our soldiers with the cybernetic interfaces they'll need to deploy these mechs onto the battlefield. We'll consult with Dr. Valand for the requisite amputations and begin installing the cybersuit interfaces as soon as possible. The cybernetic interfaces are holding stable, but they're of no use without a cybersuit to interface with. I suggest we manufacture one immediately. When our new mech trooper equips that suit, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised with its capabilities.
strike module is a powerful yet precise weapon. It can provide a decisive advantage in close quarters and remove the benefit of cover from our enemies. Sí, comandante. Sí, comandante. Sí, comandante. Sí, comandante. Multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the hologlobe. France is sending an urgent mission request. Local government forces have reported a coordinated alien attack in a densely populated neighborhood. They're counting on us to secure the area. This is Big Sky. Strike team has reached the AO. Requesting authorization to deploy. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage. Heading 
to that location. Visual on the goods. Boy. This is a disturbing sight, to say the least. It's hard to differentiate where the organic material ends and the machine begins. It's not going to win any beauty contests, that's for sure. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Я уже там. Heading to that location. Overwatch, aye aye. confirmed already there Bigu. If I had to hazard a guess, based on its profile, I'd say the aliens developed this unit with the intention of tracking and isolating single targets. It appears to have a sophisticated evasion system as well. Perhaps we should try to avoid those tentacles.
Выполняю. Быть не может. А ее бойку Контенедор recogido. Я бой. Я пошла. Смотрю внимательно. Боя, я, я. начинать. 
moving. No way that just happened. Начинаю наблюдение. successful operation. Dr. Vaughn expects our troops to try to bring one of those things back here in one piece, much less alive. Despite its physical appearance, this machine doesn't seem to be made up of any organic components. Its surface has an unusual metallic composition that somehow interacts with the vapors it releases for concealment. Flesh and metal troubles me. What do we risk with our own investigations into the melding of human and machine? Will we see a line in the sand and refuse to cross it? Or will we move forward, willing to sacrifice everything for the sake of total victory? I have to believe that is not our future, provided, of course, that the alien's technology remains in the right hands. Thank you. 
We're receiving a transmission from the council. Coming on screen. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. is sending an urgent mission request. There's been widespread speculation about this ambush on a French military convoy, but we don't have much to go on. Our primary concern is the Council Intel report indicating alien activity in the area. We need to secure the site and look for some clue as to what happened here. New objective received. Overwatch, aye aye. En observation. Aye aye, Commander. On Overwatch. the move. On the 
destination. Good to go. Eyes on the prize. I'm on it, Commander. Roger that. Scanning. Yes, sir. On my way. Scanning. I'm on it, Commander. That alien is unusually human in its appearance. They could be using it as an infiltration unit of some kind. I'd recommend capturing it for further analysis. No way that just happened. I'm on it, Commander. I'm on it, Commander. Moving to Overwatch. Got it. Moving. Headed there now. Overwatch confirmed. <laughs> 
Those bodies don't look like they've been hit by alien weapons fire. These men were killed by conventional bullets. Aye, aye, Commander. Enemy Sensors inside. still indicate life signs in the area, Commander. We have a new objective. the only witness to survive this fight and for all we know he was one of the aggressors we need to bring him in whether he likes it or not objectives updated moving into the AO. up out there. We've got hostiles on the move.
Ok, je bouge. I'm all over it. Something over here. He's down. Hostile contacts moving on your position. He changed the position! Well done. Now you just need to eliminate any remaining hostiles. Objective updated.
Reloaded. Yeah, Chef. Cooperative at the moment, but I have a feeling a talk with Dr. Valen will change his tune.
I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. 